Yeah, let's get a sniffer running. If Abstergo pings us, pull me out. Okay. I have a visual. Hey there. This is probably disorienting, so I'll be brief. I'm Bishop. Not my real name, obviously, but that's as much as you'll get today. Please listen carefully. Abstergo is using you, hijacking your neurons to help them sift through genetic memory data. These guys throw out their fingers in countless corporations, governments, media outlets, and NGOs. But now, they want control over history itself. If that doesn't frighten you, it should. But we're here to stop them, and I need your help. Deacon, preload gene sequence, uh, AD16, B13, I87. Yep, spooling it up. Last week, we gained access to a bank of unsequenced memories in Abstergo's Helix servers. For now, we'd like you to experience a small sample. This should help you understand our struggle. And after that, you can decide for yourself what comes next. We'll be waiting. Welcome back. Now that you've experienced life as an assassin, are you willing to pick up the fight and join us? Deacon? Load the file. Coming up. We lifted a media file from Abstergo last month, and the information it contains is astounding. But we won't share these things with just anyone. By pressing play, you'll be joining the assassins. If you want to fight the Templar menace, if you're willing to save civilization from Abstergo's clutches, press play, sit back, and ready yourself for the truth. So, this is where we stand. Last year, Abstergo acquired the body of a man we call a sage, one of a rare breed of humans with a surplus of ancient DNA. This sparked a search for more sages, in the present and in the past. The more Abstergo finds, the closer they get to their final goal. We've blocked their recent attempts to find more, but Abstergo will not stop looking until they sequence a full precursor genome. So, why Arno Dorian? Why chase an assassin through the French Revolution? It turns out, at some point in his life, Arnaud came into contact with another sage. We need you to find out when and where these meetings took place. If Arnaud was present for this sage's death, it might lead Abstergo straight to his body. Naturally, we'd like to find it first. This is where you come in. It won't be simple. Genetic memory must be tackled in sequence to keep the data stable. But we're confident you're up to the task. And you won't be alone. Other initiates, assassins just like you, are doing their part to end this fight. If you need more training, more experience, you can call on them for help. All right. Loading the next sequence. I've got something else for you. The more time you spend with Arno, the more data we'll have to increase your synchronization with him and to activate his abilities. Here. Have a look at this. One last thing. While you've been busy, I had Deacon do some poking around in Arno's memories. Seems he was a busy guy. See that symbol? That's a co-op mission. I play a lot of games multiplayer. I don't know about you, but I thought you'd like to mix it up a little. These are missions Arno ran with his assassin buddies, so they'll give you an idea of what our organization's about. Just walk into the glitch and you'll get all the details. I've marked them on your map. Jesus, Deacon, do you read? What the hell is that? I'm here, Bishop. That's a server sweep. Observer's looking for you, and they're close. Damn it. Can you open a server bridge? Hey, come on, it's me. Already on it. Couple of seconds. Initiate, we're opening a server bridge. Find the portal and pass through before the sweep finds you. Got it, go. Do you see it? They're hard to miss. Jumping from one Helix server to another should buy you a few more hours. If it doesn't, we're screwed. Well, we're not screwed. It's your initiate that gets the brunt. Deacon, you're not helping. The signal's holding. Good. You're waiting outside the main simulation now. This will throw Abstergo off your trail for a while, but you'll also run into a lot of incomplete and corrupted code. Which probably explains why the people here aren't quite here. Hmm, looks like the late 1800s. Now this is a Paris I wouldn't mind visiting. Maybe another time. Right now, you need to get to the exit portal. I can't see a path through though. See if you can find a route underground. That's it. I'm reading a route through the metro station ahead. Oh shit. 
This area is becoming unstable. You need to get underground. Now! Hurry! There you are. And you found the exit. Good. It's an unstable vortex of energy, so there's no telling how it will disrupt the simulation. It looks like you'll have to climb Lady Liberty. She must have bled through from another time period. The French should have shipped her off to the States by now. Just get to the portal. I'll do what I can to stop it from closing. See you on the other side. And we're back. Not everyone is so fortunate their first time through a bridge. Sometimes, our initiates are trapped in the system, and we have no choice but to send someone like you in to rescue them. In fact, one of our initiates is caught in a Bellapox server right now. If you're not too exhausted, you can re-enter the bridge and rescue him. All right, back to work, initiate. Initiate, Bishop here. You're in good shape so far. I'd like to give you a little boost. We've made a major breakthrough on our side. Through deep data analysis, we've discovered that the sage we're looking for was a Templar Grandmaster, the same man Arnaud was hunting. It doesn't get much better than that. There, everything's been updated. Use them wisely. We'll be in touch. Initiate, this is Bishop. Do you copy? Good bloody work out there. You found him. Francois Thomas Germain. Grandmaster of the Templars and a sage to boot. By our reckoning, that's the second sage to rise to the Templar's highest rank. A troubling trend. Until we know more about this Germain, stick with Arno. He might have outlived this Grandmaster, and that could lead us to his body. Bishop out. Bloody hellfire. Sorry to interrupt, you know, what was quite a poignant moment, but we've got more trouble. Bishop, are you there? I hear it. You know what to do. Opening a bridge now. You know, Deacon. I think Abstergo are still riled up about your job last month. Oh, you don't say. Okay, the bridge is open. Go. You can't snoop around Abstergo's secret data without ruffling a few feathers, right? Well, we didn't just snoop, did we? We stole their data, destroyed their precursor samples, and uh, what else? Oh yeah, we melted a few of their servers. That'll do it. Oh, here we go again. Back inside a mess of broken code. This time, the portal is above you, a few hundred meters. There it is, your way out. Hurry! I don't want to alarm you, but the portal is highly unstable. Damn it, it's gone. Keep going, we can reopen it. That should do it, you'll have to jump. keep these transfers to a minimum, okay? Hey, come off it. That's entirely up to your initiate, my friend. I'm not the one leaving so many digital footprints around Paris. You might confuse them for tiny doggy pats. Noted. We'll call you if we need you. Initiate, do you read me? I'm sorry about all this noise. There's a waterfall of signal distortion. It's not looking good. How about one more boost before I lose this connection? Sending you the data now. You're close to the goal, okay? So hold fast. Our own research couldn't locate the date and place of Germain's death. So you'll have to find it yourself. Bishop out. I want that money, right? Damn it. They're on to us again. It's not the best time, is it? I'm on it. Two seconds. Okay, we're close, Initiate. Arno and Germain had some kind of confrontation within the next few months, but we don't know where or how it ended. We're counting on you to find out. Got it. The portal's open. If all goes well, this is your last force migration. Yeah, and if it doesn't go so well, you could go into hippocampal shock and take your meals through an IV for the rest of your life. Let's not dwell on that, shall we? This might look familiar to you. We're back in medieval Paris, late 14th century. You're outside the city walls now. I suggest you find your way back. 
my god. I don't believe what I'm seeing. I won this fight two centuries before it started. Well done, kid. Uh, I don't think Abstergo will bother searching the catacombs for Jermaine's body. The bones are going to be too damaged, too decayed. We're in the clear at this stage. You did good work, Initiate. Until we contact you again, the best you can do is continue searching Arnold's memories for anything else he might have seen, like rare historical data, more DNA samples, anything to help our cause. We'll be in touch when we need you. Count on it.